Okay guys, so when you're home alone and you feel that you want to cook something and have basic ingredients, so let's put some Mexican cheese, heavy cream, some prawns, like I chopped off the mushrooms and a bit of capsicum. I did put this vegetable oil spread and I mixed it properly. And excuse me, um, that is the tomato paste that's there and I know it, it would smell good so I didn't wash it. And also partly the reason that uh, I'm kind of lazy. Uh, no, sorry, it's not that. I really like the flavor, you know. And okay, so now I'm gonna pour this into this. So let me drain the water. So I'm back draining the water. And now I'm gonna pour this here. I'm just always kind of scared of putting stuff like this. And my mom says me that I put it just slowly below. Okay, one more thought that I was never any way interested in cooking before, but just staying alone and of course this beautiful kitchen makes me cook a lot. So I'm really enjoying these days before moving to the dorm, so I'm just cooking and cooking. And yeah, it's just like I don't know, like I'm enjoying this. So I think it's good. Um, is there something more? I'm alone, so this is my portion, so if you're making for your family, you can have a bit more, you know, more stuff. I know, I now have to put kids in separately so that they don't get stuck with one another, and mushroom cooks really, really very fast, and so is corn. Um, this would be my mom said, and I don't know basic of it. And this was in the fridge, and I didn't defrost it, because it wasn't that, you get that, I guess. And so there's a reason I just you know wash it with hot warm water and it has no skillet so that's good for a lazy person like me i'm just adding a little bit more of this vegetable oil spread because i don't want it to be you know i want it to be have a bit of oil and this is a good one i <laughs> mean this is a good one i'm not you know broadcasting that way, I mean, and I'm gonna stir fry it, keep on stir frying it. And I guess the, the vegetable oil spread is really good now. And I'll just flip on the prawn so that... Okay, so one more fun fact in the US that I went to Master Walk and there were options to choose from the buffet. And I was like, oh, I'll take the prawns. And they were like, what's prawn? I was like, oh, that one. I was like, oh, shrimp? I was like, yeah. So sorry if you call it a shrimp. Um, and yeah, so I'm just gonna fry it and then other side so that it's cooked equally on both sides. Now it's not the time to add the heavy cream. I'll just let it simmer for more. So it's good now and I'm gonna put some water and put it there before I add the heavy cream. So let's do it. Okay, so my water is over here. I was just having my lunch and then I thought that I don't have anything for dinner and I'm very lazy today. So I'm just gonna put some, some of this water to there and let's do it. Wait for the sizzling. I'm a chef. My God, that looks scary, but I'm enjoying. So basically this doesn't have a recipe. I make it from my own what I feel like adding ingredients. I'll just take a bit of parsley and I'll let it simmer um, then I'll take paprika I don't want black pepper and make it more spicy my spice tolerance level legit decrease um, I want to add some ginger powder is it garlic or ginger? no garlic powder sorry no ginger and I'll add the onion powder oh my god it's way too high for my reach but yeah I got this so some ingredients so it's simmering well i'll just slow the heat because i don't want <laughs> something to happen and yeah now so at first i'm gonna add some red chili powder to it a lot of red chili powder i don't know why it's not opening so i need to open the other side but i'm very skeptical if a lot a chunk of it will fall so i have to be very very cautious that's what I was dreading off. I always make a mess. Um, so I drained off and this is not bad. It's like I'm making a shrimp curry or prawn curry that we used to make back in home in India. It legit looks like that but I wanted to make something Italian. Uh, so but still I'll put heavy cream in the stuff that I thought because I don't know how it's gonna taste. 
So it just looked like how my mom used to make at home. I really need to snap it right now for her. I wanna click some pictures so long as I make the video. They would be like, oh, what did you do? I was like, no, it's just by mistake. I pour a lot of red chili. But I did add some other condiments, if I remember. Okay, so without talking further, let's add some onion powder because I'm very lazy to chop any onion. And I'll make sure that I don't pour a lot of it. I just love the smell of onion. No lie. Like, I don't like the smell. I mean, I like the taste of onion. Who likes the smell? Nobody wants to be smelly. Okay, close it. And then I'll add garlic powder. My shrimp is going to be very chewy if I take a long time. Okay, that's good enough. I'm gonna stir it for, I don't know. I don't know for how long because I'm not a basic cook. Like I'm not a basic cook in the sense I don't know how to cook properly. I just mix on ingredients and it's just like me making out a recipe. And this staying in the Airbnb is, and this is staying alone by myself is the way I'm learning it. And um, that I'm was that's what I'm enjoying a lot. I'm like, oh my god, I'm, I'm just becoming so good at doing stuff by myself. And this is look like my mom's prawn curry. To be honest, I'm not gonna lie. I know that's more tasty what my mom's make like my mom makes. Now the best part I'll add some um heavy cream and the cheese. Let's put it. I just love heavy cream and how it tastes, and, you know. I put more because I love creamy textures. That's that's good enough. Because it's just me who's Mexican for cheese. I love it. I had cheddar in my fridge, but okay, that's good enough. I'll just put it this way. Jeez. <laughs> okay, my experiment wasn't bad. It looks so delicious. It looks just like restaurant. I mean, I'm not kidding, I'm not bragging, but it looks like a restaurant. I'm like, oh my god, I, I'm just a good cook now. Um, yeah, I'm, I feel really proud of myself at this point in my life where I never cooked ever in my life and now I'm just experimenting so much. So this is a very quick easy recipe so if you stay alone home and you have nothing to do and you want to enjoy your winter break, you know, trying cuisines and stuff. I think this is something good and this is just all what I made myself it's not a you know a cookbook guide it's just me feeling like so all now I'm gonna add see the bubbles I love it I'm gonna add parsley because it's an Italian dish so why not some bit of parsley cute I just had a sip of it and it was so good it tastes it's not my bragging because I made it but it's just for my own recipe and yes, if you like it, don't forget to like, comment, share, and subscribe to my channel. I don't know when I'm going to post my new video, but I'm just so excited. Cooking. And next time if I cook something, of course, I'm going to post it. And yeah, so have a happy weekend, guys.